ADSAC simulations. Active low-pass filter design example. Go to Start menu. And make a new schematic. Place two resistors. R1 and R2. Place one capacitor. Search for operational amplifier. Place the operational amplifier. Make the connections. Connect the non-inverting pin to ground. Now, it's an active low-pass filter. The gain can be adjusted by the ratio of R2 over R1. In this case we wants that the gain is 10. So, keep R1 kilo ohm and R2 10 kilo ohm. Set the gain to 80. Set the R1 to 1 kilo ohm, and R2 to 10 kilo ohm. Go to Library menu, and select AC Simulations. Pick the AC simulator and drag to drop in the schematic. Again go to Library menu select the Sources Frequency domain. Pick an alternating voltage source. On one side attach the ground and the other is fed operational amplifier via R1. To simulate the circuit add labels for input and output voltages. From the menu bar select the wire name tab. Named this wire as VN. As this is output of active low pass filter thus names this wire as Vout. Now set the frequency of AC simulator. Set the start frequency to 10 kHz. And stop frequency to 20 MHz. Set the step size equal to 1 kHz. Now we are all set and now we can proceed for simulations. Hit the simulation run button or press F7. After the simulation get completed. Now you can plot your results. We want to plot the gain versus frequency. For this we need to add an equation to compute the gain. Press the equation icon, and the write the equation. In this case, the gain would be the ratio of output voltages to input voltages. You can see that V in and V out variables are present because we have added by adding labels. So, write the equation for gain using input and output voltages. Now, the gain variable is ready to plot. Take the rectangular plot. Under the data sets, select the equation. Add the gain variable to plot. Go to Plot Options and select the x-axis as a log scale. These are the required results. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe my channel.